to week 12. Your first trimester is almost over. Your baby is now the size of a large mushroom. Your baby now has all her organs, muscles, limbs, and bones. She's looking more like a person too, thanks to her eyes moving in from the sides of her head to the front of her face. Her skeleton, which is made of rubbery cartilage right now, is starting to harden into bone. She's also making sucking movements and opening and closing her little hands. While your baby might only be a couple of inches long, your uterus is about the size of a grapefruit. Thanks to all the progesterone and estrogen in your body, your boobs have been looking fuller for the past few weeks too. With the end of the first trimester, your risk of miscarriage drops significantly. Only an estimated 2 to 3% of pregnancies that make it to the second trimester end in miscarriage. After 20 weeks, that drops to less than 0.5%. That's why a lot of women come out of the closet around week 13. If you're telling everyone about your pregnancy this week, get ready. You're about to get an onslaught of unsolicited advice. Get used to it. This continues throughout pregnancy, birth, and parenthood. Have you made up your mind about whether or not you're finding out the sex of your baby? After you make the announcement, everyone is going to ask you what you're going to do. As your baby bump gets bigger, you may need to bite the bullet and buy some actual maternity clothes. Start with some new bras. Maternity pants or jeans are also worth the investment. You'll wear them a lot. And you'll want some stretchy tops. Now that you're moving past the fatigue and nausea of the first trimester, you might feel more like exercising. But don't push yourself too hard. Be sure to listen to your body. You should be able to carry on a conversation while you're exercising and ask your instructor if you need to make any more modifications to your routine. Congratulations, you're gonna be a great mom.